Okay, I'm in the lobby of the Milan. All right, let's do it. I'm hacking in. Look at that. Secrets and lies floating in a cloud of data. I just reach out, pluck it from the sky, and it's mine. It's ours. Stay focused. We got a nasty security system. How much we got? A hundred grand in 30 seconds. God bless the rich and famous. We are the modern day magicians. Siphoning bank accounts out of thin air. Do you hear yourself? <laughs> I think someone else is hacking in. Yeah. Let's take a peek. Let's not. Stick to the plan, Damien. Siphon the accounts and get out. Adventure, my boy. Have faith in your mentor. Something triggered that alarm. Let's find it. Shit. It's scanning the system. I'm almost there. I'm shutting down now. Don't you touch a thing. What the hell is that? We need to abort. We are not done. Damien, it's over. I'm disconnected. Maurice. Yeah? You're on. One of our contractors ran a search for the hackers in the Merlot job. You're assigned Aiden Pierce. Take him out. Hit the family if you need to. This guy's hacking days are done. Hit the family? Not a problem? Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. Gave the order. Come on. Don't. I don't know. You don't know. Hit the family? Not a problem. Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. What do you think, Maurice? Did you scare me? It was a job, man. I didn't know. Who was on the other end of the call? Give me a name. They never gave me a name. Yeah, and I'll tell your name. Well, Lena. Lena Pierce. I didn't know about any kids, all right? That wasn't supposed to happen. I want you to think very carefully. Think. Look, man. Even if I knew a name, you couldn't get me talking. These guys... I heard stories, man, that are like nothing you ever seen before. You gotta walk away from this, man. Some things you can't walk please, away from. Please! Who gave the order? I spoke to them on the phone and they told me where to find you. That's all I know, man. That's all I know. Give me a name. I don't know! A name! Kill me, man. Just fucking kill me. How's your memory now? Uh. Uh. 
Maurice won't talk to me, but I bet he talked to you. Shaking, motherfucker. Where the hell you been? What? He's talking to me. I leave you for two minutes. Give me my bullets. I tossed them. But you said you'd kill them otherwise. I told you to hold on to them, Jordy. Where you been anyway? I had to make a call. And you get what you need from Maurice? Ah, oh, you're kidding me. Let's clean this mess up. Stop admiring your work. Hey, that's cute and all, but I'm disappointed, Pierce. I mean, you failed to spot the nasty inter-gang drama I'm creating here. I don't like loose ends. Let's get him out of here. No, too late. Bottom of the eighth. Chicago's ahead. Game's almost over. We are out of time. <laughs> nice shot. Huh. Come on, you're not just a little interested in my phone call. All right, fine. Tell me about your phone call. Glad you asked. Okay, we got a bunch of dead bodies, right? We got 40,000 people above us. We need a distraction. I called the cops. You did? Oh, yeah. True story. So, cops arrive, and Maurice's little band of brothers arrive, and pow, 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 pow. Jordy, tell me you're joking. No, no, I called them, too. Look, we get a messy altercation at the end of the game. You and I slip away undetected. You'll appreciate the plan tomorrow. Great. Punctual cops. I handle these guys. You grab Maurice, get him out of here. Maurice? What do I look like, a chauffeur? He's the shooter. I'm not through with him yet. Hey. Ugh. Dick. Chicago police! If there's anybody in here, identify yourselves. Why'd they have to pick the biggest game of the season to pull this shit? I'm trying to ruin it for everybody? We've got two bodies in the basement of May Stadium. Gangbangers. Copy. We're sending forensics. Secure your position for now. We're sweeping each level of the stadium. All right. Doesn't look right to me. Why are they killing each other? And why here, of all places? Looks like a gang hit. Wait. You think it's the vigilante? Does feel like his brand of justice, don't it? Yeah. I wouldn't give to get my hands on that piece of shit. Today, and this game couldn't be any closer. Big base deal is on this set, so foul. Looks like it unlocks from the other side. Roger's not falling for that one. Both men, of course, experts at the mind game. Two on, two out, folks. Something's gonna give soon, and it could go. See anything? Nope. Quiet here. We've got a known viceroy in the VIP lounge. We're gonna check him out. Okay, I'm coming up. He's not moving unless I give him a reason. Just talking. Hey, man, look, I got my tickets right nope. here. No, keep your hands where I can hey, see them. this is bullshit. Jay didn't do nothing wrong. Get back now. You're viceroys, aren't you? That ain't illegal, right? Don't get smart. How did you two afford VIP tickets? Mm, bet she makes more than you do. Yeah? Hey, yo, what? Didi, calm down, all right? Don't give him nothing to make a use. 
Something tells me if we run you shit stains through the system, we'll come up with plenty we can use. Bad boy. The police are about to lock this whole place down. I'm stuck unless we create a major distraction. I want to cut the power and slip past them. Do it all stay here? I thought you wanted to keep the vigilante out of the news. Everything's connected to the CTOS with a serious firewall. Right now, I need to get out of the stadium. Can you find me the nearest access point? In the next room. Well, you'll need to find someone with security clearance. Security guard should have access. With all these cops, there's gotta be one around. Hey, you Alan? Yeah, I am. You got an evacuation plan, right? Of course we do. Good, we need to get moving on it. We're not gonna evacuate 40,000 people so we can play cowboys and Indians. But you got an isolated incident in the basement, we can close the basement. I got no problem with that. This whole place is about to fill up with Chicago PD. That's gonna cause a panic. We need to shut the game down and get people out of here safely. Oh, shut it down? I... I can't make that call. Well, then call somebody who can make that call, please. Okay, hang on. Yeah, get me Barry. Uh, uh, well, tell him to call me ASAP. It's an emergency. That'll do it. Uh, so just how bad are things down there? Uh, we don't know yet. We're dealing with a crime scene, though. The coroner's on his way. Now, why this gotta happen on my watch? Jesus! Where are you, Jordy? What? Gone. I'm allergic to cops. So is Maurice. But don't worry, I left you a present. Friend of a friend deals in pre-owned cars. Got a real beauty waiting for you in the garage across the street. Take it or leave it. I don't care. Gotta go. There's a bunch of cops fly by out there. That's a lot of sirens for a blackout. Shit, something in here. We should stay put. Squad suspect has to be nearby. Keep looking. I needed this bad. Finally got the goddamn trigger man. Just need to break through. How? Push Maury's hard. Torture's not gonna work on this guy, so I need to get inside his head. The guilt is eating him up. I'll give him a couple of days, and then I'll start reaching out. Maurice was correct. We've gained access to the CTUS backdoor while the police were being distracted by you. Since we both went in this, we'll share what we have. That backdoor allows you some access to the CTUS network. I'm still working on something bigger. Give me time. Hi, Fixer. 
to help me find the shooter. Jordy Chin. I'm skeptical at first because the guy's eccentric. He's got a motor mouth. He says I'm wearing a fancy suit to work. So far he delivers. 